For an expectant mother, exposure to toxic e-waste can affect the health and development of her unborn child for the rest of its life. Children exposed to electronic waste are particularly vulnerable to the toxic chemicals as this affects the rapid rate of growth and development. What exactly are the adverse effects of e-waste? New Centro's Chidem Matwosu tells us more in this report. In recent times, Nigerians are being exposed to electronic waste through constantly setting ablaze of unused substances, toxic fumes, as well as contaminating underground drinking water. These indiscriminate disposal and informal recycling have posed a serious public health risk to the environment. Nigeria being a third world country, we majority of these people cannot afford brand new um, electronic devices. So secondhand electronic devices are usually Im imported into Nigeria from overseas, right? And, you know, all in the name of bridging the gap, you know, in electronic development, in the name of um, reusing of these materials within the country. But whereas um, over 40% of these um, materials, of these um, um, secondhand electronic devices that are sent here to Nigeria are not reusable. A new World Health Organization report warns that pregnant women's exposure to electronic waste raises the risk of stillbirth and premature birth. Many of the chemicals in electronic waste have been shown to have the potential to cause DNA damage in both mothers and fetuses. It's of public health important because uh, these categories of women who are in developing country and uh, those who are located in areas where these uh, waste are being recycled are the people who are most infected or uh, will I say the people who are most affected by it. You know, but uh, not to leave the fact that um, electronic waste affects everybody generally, but uh, coming down to the aspect where it begins to affect uh, the pregnant women and the fetus becomes uh, more of public health importance. And uh, there are various modalities that have been put in place to see that uh, these factors have been reduced so that uh, the incidence of people coming down with spontaneous abortion, low birth weight, still birth, uh, is reduced in the, in the society at large. This should be a serious concern in Nigeria, with a population of about 200 million people. The World Health Organization estimates that Nigeria generated 64.2 billion naira worth of electronic waste in 2019 and ranks second in Africa after Egypt. There is an urgent need for governments at all levels to take the disposal and treatment of electronic waste seriously to safeguard the environment and public health. Chirima Mwosu, reporting for News Central.